Welcome to Chris Linford Co.uk Get Going Guides. This podcast is all about using a piece of software called Freeway and it's made by a company called Softpress and you can find lots of information about it on www.softpress.com. I'm not associated with the company but I find it a great piece of software to make websites with uh, as opposed to any others and it's a very flexible uh, way of working. Uh, it's only available on the Apple Macintosh system uh, and there's a few versions depending on your operating system that you can use. I'm using version 5.6 which is the latest version on the latest operating system when I recorded this. Freeway is about making websites and not worrying about the code. You generate the page like you would in InDesign or Quark Express or any other major desktop publishing software and if you're used to using uh, those packages you should find the freeway very easy to use which is basically drawing a box and putting something into it. So you can concentrate on design rather than whether to do it in PHP or HTML or XHTML, Java and all the other different kinds of programming languages uh, you can use uh, on the website and it also has the advantage that it offers a great many add-ons uh, to customize websites and make them do different things um, and these are normally free. There are some that you have to pay for, but about 95% of all the add-ons you can get for special effects are free. Uh, their website's very useful. Uh, it's got uh, information uh, on the freeway package itself and tells you uh, bits about it. Uh, there's all products that they do, because they do do a few other products. There are two versions of Freeway. There's Freeway Pro and there's Freeway Express. I'm using the Pro version. Uh, Freeway Express is a cheaper uh, and available on the App Store uh, and has a few limitations of things that it can do. So it doesn't allow every kind of effect feature that you want to put into your website and um, but you can easily upgrade it to the Pro if you prefer. Uh, the good thing about it is they have an excellent support section uh, on it which has simple things like an FAQ section, a knowledge base um, and help sections all the way through. It also has lots of training uh, information, tutorials, discussions and you can download manuals and all sorts of different things from it. Also if you do get really stuck you can send them an email and they will get back to you with some help or even if you have a wish list or something you want to do uh, they might find a way uh, to do it for you. Um, with the support there's also a very good uh, podcast available uh, on iTunes. If you just go into the iTunes store uh, and search on podcasts uh, for Freeway or Softpress, Paul Dunning, uh, one of their developers uh, at their HQ, has made some fantastic uh, videos. Um, so if some of my videos don't seem very clear, you might find something there that is very useful uh, for you to look at and to uh, have a different point of view on how to do things. So the podcasts are very good and you can just download them as video tutorials uh, as you can on my podcast um, on iTunes and on um, YouTube. Um, so they have a lot of very interesting effects. It's very easy to use. Uh, you just need to know how to use it. And if we just open up a little freeway document that I've got here, um, it's pretty straightforward. There's a nice simple layout. You have all your pages here. If you're used to InDesign or Quark Express then you will know about master pages. If you don't it's sort of a template page where you can have standard designs on it. We'll go through this later on. And below here you have all the pages on your website. You can just click on them and go through to the different bits uh, of your website that you've made. The main thing is you have a toolbar these are all movable, uh, so you can move them around. Um, the toolbar is very simple. We'll go through that uh, in the next uh, tutorial. And you have an inspector, which gives you information on what you're looking at uh, on your page. Or if you click on an item, it will give you information on what that item is. Uh, so it's pretty straightforward, fairly simple to use. Uh, good thing with the toolbar is you don't need to have it open all the time because all the tools are available at the top of the screen uh, as well. And 
the menus are pretty much like working in InDesign uh, or Quark Express uh, with the added feature that you can add things that you can put on websites that you can't put on a printed page like interactive videos, uh, flash documents, um, email links, animations, all sorts of different things uh, that aren't available in a web page. Um, so that's Freeway, it's very simple. Uh, you can go to their website. Uh, if you want to work along with these tutorials, you can go to their download section and there they offer a full 30 day trial version of their uh, software. So you can just download it, install it onto your machine, give it a go for 30 days, have a go through the tutorials that I'm going to lead you through um, and then if you like it you can possibly buy it. It's probably not too expensive um, but it is very flexible uh, to work with. So that's it, uh, Freeway. Uh, the next tutorials will be showing you how to actually use it and uh, what you can do with it. Uh, so find me on YouTube or on uh, iTunes as well as www.chrislinford.co.uk